Hey guys, when I first started this channel, I talked mostly about TOS or thoracic outlet syndrome because that's my disability. And um, I kind of got a little frustrated after a while because it's such a rare condition that uh, not that many people really know what it is. So it kind of felt like, you know, I was making these videos, but not that many people were watching them because you know, it's such a rare thing. And um, I, um, I made that comment on a, a, a video. Uh, Tim Schmoyer has a channel where he helps people, um, you know, grow their YouTube channels. And I, and I mentioned that to him and he said, you know what you should do? He said, chronic pain is a really big problem. You should branch out and um, start making your videos more about chronic pain in general. He goes, you can use TOS as your example of why you're in pain, but you can reach and probably help a lot more people if you, uh, you know, if you talk about chronic pain in general. And so as I started doing that, it took some time, but it's kind of caught on more. And then, um, you know, eight months ago, my wife passed away. So I made some videos about that because I figured, you know what? That's emotional pain, and um, a lot of people seem to watch those and kind of appreciate those as well. So I kind of found that um, when I just talk about things that I'm dealing with, um, those videos seem to be pretty popular. Stuff that just kind of, you know, that's hard for me, that's just kind of, sometimes I turn on the camera and talk about it. I think it helps me, and if it helps other people, as well um, that's a good thing people have said I like the videos because it's nice to hear that you know someone else is dealing with the same you know kind of problems that I have because really unless you're you have pain or chronic pain you really don't understand it most people that don't have it they don't understand it so I don't really even talk about it that much in my regular life because nobody gets it um, you know, even like when you go to the doctor, they don't get it. When my when my wife and I first got together, she never questioned my pain, but um, until she started having chronic pain herself, then she started understanding what I was talking about a lot more. In fact, she would get really frustrated. She'd go to a doctor or something and she'd come home all like irritated and say, you know, they didn't do anything and blah, blah, blah. She says, it's exactly like the things you would tell me. You know, you go to doctors, they don't listen to you. They want you to just try this or try that. And you say, well, I've already done that. And like, and it didn't work. And they like still want you to try that again. And you keep wasting all this time and wasting all this money. And, um, you know, after a while she started to, to really get it. And she's like, you know, you really, I think you're really doing a good thing doing those videos because, you know, like, like you guys say, it's nice to hear, people like to hear um, someone else that, someone that actually understands it. And I definitely understand that I've lived with pain since I was uh, probably 18, 19 years old. I started having problems and it just gradually got worse and worse over time. And I've been on disability since I was in my early 30s after I had a lower back surgery that really didn't work out it made me worse and then i had surgery for thoracic outlet syndrome and that made me worse so um so after being all excited that people doctors finally figured out what was wrong with me i had the surgeries and all they did was kind of finish me off and make me even worse so um you know and then um over the last five six years i've found things that, that really helped me quite a bit because I used to lay in bed most of the time or a lot during the day, but I've started finding things like joint mobility exercises, vacuum cupping and self massage. Those are the three main things that have helped me, but it was a really long, slow process. In fact, I used to talk about starting a YouTube channel and talking about this stuff, but then I'd make a little progress and then I'd get a big flare up and I'd be in all this pain. I'm like, well, Maybe it's never gonna happen. I maybe I'll never get good enough that to really talk about this stuff because it I won't feel like it really helped me that much. But I'm to the point now where usually once I'm out of bed in the morning, 
I can, you know, stay up and, you know, I can't do tons, but at least I don't have to keep going and laying down all the time anymore. So I have, you know, made progress. Um, anyway, that's my video for today. Thanks for watching. Talk to you guys next time. Always beautiful. Sometimes it's just plain hard. Life can knock you down. It can break your heart.